One of the very exciting things about the stroke program here at Christiana Care Heart and Vascular is that we're able to deal with any neurovascular emergency 24 hours, seven days a week. We can deal with acute strokes, which means there's a blockage of a blood vessel in the brain, either by giving medicine through an IV in the arm and allowing that clot to, to dissolve and restore blood flow to the brain and prevent, hopefully, serious permanent damage. Alternatively, if that initial approach is not successful, we have the capability to minimally invasively remove the clot from the brain. We have several devices and techniques to remove uh, these clots. And what sets Christiana apart is the fact that we're the only center that has 24-7 uh, coverage to remove these uh, blockages. The first uh, basic technique is to get to the level of the blockage in the brain through a small incision in the groin. Um, and at the, the, the blockage, we could actually deliver some uh, clot-busting medicine, or TPA, and that would allow the clot to dissolve and hopefully restore blood flow to the brain and prevent uh, progression of a patient's stroke that would potentially leave them with serious um, permanent disability. Secondarily, if that blood thinning medicine was not an option, uh, we can use alternative techniques. There's two FDA-approved devices, which we have here at Christiana. Uh, one of them is the Mercy Retrieval device, and the second is the Penumbra device, both of which are mechanical devices that actually remove the clot from the brain, um, and again, in an attempt to improve uh, blood flow to the brain and minimize any potential stroke and permanent disability. It's, it's very important for patients that have an acute stroke or if you think somebody you know is having an acute stroke to get to the hospital in a very timely manner. Things that would indicate that somebody was having an acute stroke would be difficulties with their speech, uh, trouble walking, um, weakness on one side, um, perhaps p even passing out. Those are all signs of serious strokes and patients that have that or if you see somebody with those signs you should call 911 and that patient should be rushed to the emergency department. This is a very time sensitive disease process and patients will do better if they get to the hospital as quickly as possible. One of the things that really sets Christiana apart is the fact that we have a, a very large volume of stroke admissions in this uh, hospital. Uh, it's, it was a surprise to me and it would probably be a surprise to many of the people in the area to know that Christiana sees the second highest number of inpatient stroke admissions in the country. And uh, what that means for patients is that we're used to seeing a lot of strokes and we're used to dealing with strokes. Uh, patients go very rapidly through the system and are treated appropriately. Um, there are dedicated stroke neurologists neurointerventionalists, neurosurgeons, and uh, neurocritical care physicians to deal with strokes from the uh, regular floor beds to a dedicated uh, stroke treatment and recovery unit as well as dedicated neurocritical care beds. And I think that gives patients the opportunity to be treated very, very efficiently and be treated by uh, experts in the field.